being on the water or just on land working on boats is exactly what I want to do. I studied physiotherapy first, but I've always been into sailing. So the first skill is building the boat, learning why it's built the way, why how it works, and then using that in my sailing. We take uh, 15 students per class, which will mean level 2, 3 and 4, 15 each. So it's half of your qualification is work placement. Um, I've got a passion about what I do, and I also love teaching students because it helps them to develop themselves. Knowing the boat, knowing how it's built, working with the people that's done it for many years, you learn the skills they've been doing, you get the experience in the workplace. It's very important for them to go into the workplace to see how it's actually done. We find that when the students come back to the college to do the next six months of theoretical and practical training at the college, they are better equipped. They have better knowledge, they are more punctual, they have a better attitude towards because now they are aware of what the trade that they're studying entails and how they can develop it into the future. We're lucky in the sense that we do a little bit of everything. We do plumbing, we do electrical, composites, which is like a house on the water. So the wooden boat has been coming on for an extremely long time and it's sometimes it's a skill that people have lost to be able to, to build wooden boats. But it's also still important to, be, to have that woodworking skills because that gets used within the interior of the boat. And so many times people want beautiful cabinets or carpentry or tables made and that is where the skill comes in. In Cape Town we what second, I read that we second biggest boat manufacturers in the world to France. So when it comes to employing people, it's like every day there's someone getting employed, I would think, in the boat building because it's such a growing field. A boat building tradesman, your money is fixed, your going rate is fixed, you can budget, you can buy a house, you can buy a car, and the money will be more because you are qualified tradesman in our case. So you can live and budget like anybody else, you can earn more money than a doctor. I was fortunate enough to go to a company where we, where I did like almost everything. But I know that when spoken to my peers and stuff, they are placed in one place, just doing one thing for six months. So a good thing would be to move us around while we're doing work placement, just so that we can experience a little bit of everything. And from there decide, maybe I just want to focus on carpentry, or maybe I just want to focus on fitting or plumbing or electrical. My message is to companies is to make every workplace a learning space that companies should open their doors, they should become workplace approved with their CETAs that they, that they feed into. As soon the more students we can employ, the more it will help the, the Western Cape economy.